Breaking news, Tinubu finally throws Buhari under the bus for the first time says Buhari has not done well. Tells Nigerians, Nigeria cannot progress without APC being successful and the current administration has failed. Let me make it right. Hello, my wonderful people. This is Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu. I tell you that as campaign begin to go on, they'll be spilling more beans. Okay, we'll be getting more of this. The truth will begin to come out more and more and more. Yes, Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, who imposed or forced Nigerians or made Nigerians be de believe that Buhari was the way, okay, where they, where they got, you know, consultants to portray the guy in the right mood to make it look like this was the answer. Yeah, Nigerians believed, Nigerians, you know, thought that um, we, we finally arrived. Finally, the Naira will be, up to, you know, be equivalent to a dollar and we can move forward. Okay, and Tinubu has been saying he wants to build on Buhari's legacy and be deceiving himself. All of a sudden, he's made a U-turn. He said, well, this administration has failed. The administration has failed and um, he wants opportunity to make it right. He agrees that the administration has finally failed. Please do not forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Thank you. 2023, give me opportunity to make things right. APC Nigeria can't be successful without APC Nigeria can't progress without APC being successful. This administration has failed. The national leader of the All Progressive Congress, Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, has disclosed that the country cannot progress and develop without the success of the of APC. The party has failed and continue to fail, so we must get things right. If given the opportunity, I will begin to iron things and put things properly. Report that the governor, the former governor of Lagos State, made this known in a statement issued on Monday by his spokesman Tunde Ratman. The presidential hopeful added that the stability of the country greatly depends on the democratic commitment and efforts of the ruling or progressive Congress, and the party must get it right for Nigeria to move forward. Tinubu asks APC members to unite to ensure that the party keeps its progress in making Nigeria a prosperous nation. Tinubu said the current administration has not really fulfilled their promises to Nigeria. The future stability and progress, progressiveness of Nigeria depends very much on stable democracy, which I am ready to provide if given the opportunity to bring a change to this very administration. We to this very administration and bring a change to the country. We must all come together to ensure we work together as faithful people to make Nigeria progress, create, pos create new possibilities and progressive ways, secure, secure employment for our people and bring in investors. Those are one of the ways the country can move forward. He also hailed the former governor of Nasarawa state and commissioned him to do right by the people and ensure the right person become the flag bearer of APC. Tinubu said APC has a lot to offer but just need the right persons to be in government so that Nigeria can truly understand that this party has got something prosperous for the nation. If given the opportunity, he will ensure that Nigerians see truly that in choosing APC in 2015 and 2019 was not a mistake. Given the opportunity, he will ensure he correct every wrong right now going on. Well, that's your very own brother, Shiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, who feels very strongly that the current administration has not given opportunity, you know, to showcase uh, what APC could possibly do. You know, he feels very much like APC has betrayed him personally because in the southern region he was one of those who you know who ensured that the south vote for Tinu, uh, Buhari yes ensured that you know the south voted for you know for for Buhari these are the same people who carried placards went out you know telling the telling everyone who cares to listen that yes uh, they must vote uh, because uh, this man is going to bring something fresh and something new is going to transform nigeria is going to do a b c d z so this is the person nigerians must come on board and at this time nigerians were i mean overheal tired and just want a difference 
Nigerians were really tired and just want somebody who could bring, you know, freshness to the table. Nigerians just want somebody who could potentially, you know, show us the way going forward. We were tired of the same thing all over again. Not knowing we're actually going from fry pan to the fire. In fact, the mistake we have made, if given the opportunity, we will never want to tread on that path again. Never, ever. So these are some of the things going on now. That some of the things we are experiencing and we are facing right now. And so the time to 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 really make the, the, the real uh, decision on what next to do is now. So Nigerians, time to arise. Time to arise and to come off, you know, the possibility of being deceived over and over again. Time to arise and make a real tangible decision on what on what's on the way forward. Because whether you like it or not, um, it's from one of these persons, yes, that have indicated interest. Whether PDP, APC, AAC, LP, AC, ACN, whatever party they may be, it's from one of these persons. Okay, all put together is one of them. All things being equal, the election holds, um, you know, this power trans, you know, power is going to be, you know, moved in by, by 2023. It is from one of those persons that will have the next president of Nigeria. And so we must make that, we must, we must do right by us. It is from, if it is from one of those persons, then we cannot afford, okay, we can't afford to play that game. We, we just can't afford it. We just, we definitely can afford it. Okay, we must say, we must say the truth once and for all. We just can afford to play the game. We just can afford to do that. Okay, the days of playing games should be over by now, and it's time for us to arise and make a real difference. Okay, so this is some of the things going on. These are some of the things befalling us right now. As you and I can see, uh, it is time to move forward. It is time to advance. It is time to to make hail while the sun shine. Because um, the elections are upon us again, and then um, these persons, these people, will be make will be will be coming out to to parade lies at us. What they normally do, they do it cleverly. They do it very well. They parade the lies so interestingly that if you are not careful, you will think that um, you know they are being sincere. They lie without without even thinking about it. They don't even have a thought about it. They just they lie conveniently. That's the word, conveniently. Okay. So these are some of the things going on. You see, please do not forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. God bless you. Have a fantastic and a lovely day from us. It's bye for now.